What's going on guys? My name's Hero. Welcome to the video. And today I'm going to be talking about the best ways to find diamonds in Minecraft, as you guys can tell by the title. And let's go ahead and get started. There's plenty of ways to find diamonds in Minecraft. And most people have, you know, not most people, but quite a few people have trouble finding diamonds. So I, want, I thought I'd make this helpful video, especially with Ninja UHC coming up soon. I wanted to make sure that, you know, the members are prepared for the, the UHC by, be able, by being able to find diamonds easily. All right, let's get started with the list. Right off the bat, we have mine shafts. Now, uh, I'm not going to be talking about the really obvious ways to find diamonds in this list uh, by just strip mining and that kind of stuff. Everyone knows about that. So uh, let's start with mine shafts because mine shafts not only do they already have you know an edge, you know, like they're always showing a face of stone blocks, so they're already kind of like a built-out mine. But in addition to that, they also have chests. And these can have diamonds in them a lot of the time. They're pretty good for that. So anyway, the next thing on the list, let's go. All right, guys. So the next one I have is the is uh, the biome. Now, one of the best biomes to find ores, just in general, is the Extreme Hills biome. However, since emeralds spawn here, that might subtract from the total diamond count here. So it's not always the best. It's not always the best biome to go with in a UHC or in something like that. As you can see, emeralds spawn in this biome, which is pretty nice, but those aren't diamonds. We want diamonds. Uh, however, lots of emeralds appear to spawn, as this is the only biome that emeralds can spawn in. So you, you tend to find quite a bit, actually. Now, as for diamonds in any biome, it's always best to mine towards, you know, lower than block 20 is usually the best. Right where I'm here at level 12, which is perfect for diamonds. However, be careful because lava also spawns at lower levels of the Minecraft world. Alright guys, here's another one. Here's tip number three, I think. Yeah, here's uh, temples. Temples are really good because you, they have chests in them, as you can see. And these do have diamonds quite a bit of the time. I can do that. As you can see, this one happens to have no diamonds, but these do happen to have diamonds quite a bit of the time. And actually, there's diamond horse armor, so I guess that's kind of a win. Uh, but you have to be careful because they, they, you know, if it's a desert temple, they can blow up because of the TNT. Uh huh. All right, guys, welcome to the tip, the second best way, which here we are on Hypixel's Bed War server. And as you can see, if we kill this guy real fast, there's actually a uh, a generator that spawns diamonds. Now. Uh, Right now it's a tier 1, so it takes about 25 seconds for it to spawn diamonds. But uh, this is a really good way to get diamonds on Minecraft. It really does help. Uh, I just want to give a shout out to Hypixel for uh, making these real fast. It's really nice. It really does help people who are new to survival and are struggling a bit. Uh, it really does help. Actually, I really wish these were around back in my day when I first started playing. because They would have helped out so much. Uh, as you can see, there's some people that get greedy, actually. And they feel the need to fight for it for some reason. I don't know. But, uh, it's definitely a really good method. And it really does, really does help uh, get diamonds. Alright guys, and the last tip I want to show you guys is that diamonds tend to spawn near pigs quite a bit, actually. Which is, most people don't know this, but uh, it really does help sometimes. So you might not want to kill the pigs, actually, because the pigs can move towards diamonds, too you just leave them be and don't kill them uh, and actually I have one more bonus tip for you guys I was I wasn't sure if I wanted to tell you guys this because I know members of the ninja UHC might watch this and I don't want to give them a really useful advice piece um, just in case they use it against me in the UHC but uh, there's actually this really good tip in actually uh, in Minecraft if you're playing on 1.8 or higher uh, for the version you can actually just smell diamonds I'm not even joking just go <laughs> Uh, actually, earlier I was smelling a quite peculiar scent from this area. Let's uh, see what's in here. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. I think I think we're getting yeah we're we're getting close, man. Uh, are we? Uh, it's gotta be like right in here. There we go. Okay, okay. Uh, let's just see how much we have here. No, it's a very strong scent, so I feel like there's uh, got to be quite a bit here. Um, and you can tell this because uh, 
you know, the, the pigs were here. So, uh, that's one of the tips. You don't want to just smell everywhere, because then, uh, you might get a nosebleed or something. It's not healthy. Um, but if you just smell where pigs are, then you can really find all the diamonds that you really want. And as you can see, just from that vein alone, uh, I got 15 diamonds. And this is actually a new survival world I just created, like, five minutes ago, and I spawned, like, right over there. So, you could be spawning with bats, I guess. You could be spawning in in areas, like, right next to diamonds. You have no idea. Like, this is how people get diamonds within the first 10 minutes of playing Minecraft, and they get and they beat the Ender Dragon in 20 minutes uh, for speedruns. That's how people do it. They don't want to admit it, but that's their secret. So, uh, anyway, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, uh, there's a button for that down below, and if you really like, there's a button for that too. But I, I really hope these tips help you guys out, and let me know in the comment section below how these tips helped you, and give me any tips that you might have. I'm kidding, I know all the tips. But if you want, you can help others in the comments for any any super obvious uh, tips and tricks that I didn't mention in this video. These were only the more advanced ones. But, uh, yeah, so uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you didn't, there's a button down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.